Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 38 in chapter 15. Chapter 15 is about waves. For this one, we can see this cable has two part light sections and heavy sections, and the leader density low, uh, ratio is given. This one. The first one we need to find is a wave, wave speed ratio. So how can we do that? We can see the wave speed for in the cable can be decided by this function, right? You can see the speed of a wave equal to squared ft divided by mu. And this mu is called density, the leader density. Ft is the tension in this cable. And we know for in one cable, the Ft is the same everywhere. So now we can write the uh, speed, the ratio Vh over Vl, right? So this part equal to, you can say you just input the V inside. And then Ft, Ft can cancel. So we get the ratio can be simplified as squared mu L mu H. These two quantities are given. The next one, you can see, we need to find the wavelength ratio for two parts. And then this part, we just get it in previous questions, right? We write it there. The next one, if we want to find the wavelength, we know wavelength is the speed times period. And in this case, the period is same because the period is just determined by frequency, 1 over f. And the frequency is same everywhere, agree? So that makes the ratio of the lambda h over l, right? Lambda l h over lambda l equal to v h over v l because this lambda and velocity is the leader relationship. Frequency is constant for two part, and then we write the v h over v l in this function, and then it is just exactly same. The next one ask you is the wavelength larger? in the heavier coil or the lighter. So we can say we get this ratio there. And then how can we decide it? We look at this function. This mu is called leader density. Uh, the light one, of course, mu L is smaller than mu H because this is heavy. This is a light. So, so for leader density, mu L smaller than mu H, so make this ratio smaller than 1. Do you agree? And this is smaller than 1 makes the lambda h is smaller than lambda l. So that makes the wavelength uh, in the heavier cord is smaller than the wavelength in the lighter part. Thank you.